The sun has been shining, it's warm outside, and the ordering windows are open at Cluck Bucket. So just follow your nose to the amazing smell of the pit in Ludington, where they're cooking up pounds and pounds of fresh chicken. 9 and 10's Lawrence Cafiti takes us inside the kitchen at the food truck to make delicious meals and memories. The pit master is out here every single morning. The cluck bucket in Ludington is open, cooking up the chicken in here before we take it to the food truck to finish it off. So let's go inside the kitchen. Hi there. Are you ready to order? Yeah. What would you like today? Sherry Eaton used to vacation in Ludington. We'd come camping at the state park every uh -huh. summer, spent every 4th of July here at the parade downtown. Her family moved here four years ago. We had always saw this lot here as a vacant lot. So they turned it into right. Cluck Bucket in 2019, Thank rolling you. in the food truck and the pit. This is where the magic happens. Some people taste summer, some people taste that smokiness from the pit, but everybody just loves it. And I think it's because we, we do, we care about what we make. That's why their slogan is Eaton Good. Our last name is Eaton, and so we say it's more than a slogan, it's family. Are you gonna eat the whole thing? The Barnett family says it's one of their <laughs> favorite places to stop in the summer. Do you like Sherry? Yeah. What do you like about Sherry? Um, see, make my favorite mac and cheese. What makes it good? Um, the cheese pot. <laughs> Eat it. <laughs> Was it good? Yeah. <laughs> so good, she drew it. The sun, Miss Sally, me, um, and the cluck bucket food truck, and mac and cheese. Linnea's masterpiece has been proudly displayed in the food truck the last year. Not pictured the nachos, which Linnea's mom, Marissa, usually reaches for. They're crispy, the chip just crunches, it's just so good. But then you've got the red sauce on top, so instead of a creamy cheese, you've got the red sauce. It's like our little liquid gold, only it's red. At night, it's our summer staple. We'll go <laughs> and eat our dinner at the beach. We've loved Lettington and came here. This was like our Walt Disney World. That's why Sherry says she loves hearing people come back year after year giving people a place to make their own memories, just like her family used to while visiting their favorite place. To know that I am now one of their spots um, just blesses me. Inside the kitchen at Cluck Bucket, I'm Lawrence Cafiti. And starting late June, you'll be able to get Cluck Bucket in two places. They're opening a location at the port in Ludington as well. And of course, if there's a restaurant you'd like to see featured, we would love to hear from you. Just send us an email to insidethekitchen at 9and10news.com.